Dude, Popeyes makes a breakfast wrap? I have to go all the way to the UK? Or we're gonna make Cajun seasoning. We're gonna make Cajun ketchup. I'm gonna use that seasoning to make Cajun bacon. I'm also gonna use that to season the chicken sausage and season the hash brown to make a Cajun hash brown. Wrap it all together and never skip bag day. UK style. For the Cajun seasoning, pretty simple. We have paprika, garlic powder, oregano, thyme, white pepper, black pepper, salt, onion powder, and for some spice, cayenne. Yeah, smells like uh, Kaja. That's not a real place. I got some thicky thick boys over here. Now when you're seasoning bacon, you wanna bake it, because if you fry it, then it's a higher chance of it, of the seasoning or whatever you're adding to it, it comes off. So in this case, and in most cases for me, I always put my bacon in the oven. It's the most efficient way to cook your bacon. You throw it in there at 385 degrees for 10 to 15 minutes. You take it out, you degrease, you flip, you put it back in for another five to 10, depending the way you like your bacon. So I'm gonna add the Cajun seasoning on top. Cajun bacon, maybe it's good. Probably is, let's be honest. Okay, now, simple, very simple. I'm gonna make Cajun ketchup. And when I say I make, I'm gonna make Cajun ketchup, all I'm really gonna do is combine our Cajun seasoning with some Heinz. I was researching this Popeye situation, and actually, some places use HP sauce, which is obviously a European, UK staple, and other places said that they made Cajun ketchup, so I don't have any HP sauce. We're making Cajun ketchup. HP sauce is very popular in uh, the UK, also in Canada, you know, British colony, quote unquote. It's essentially like a tomato-based ketchup with tamarind extract, which gives it like a nice acidity and like a sourness to it. I have had it before, but I couldn't find any here. And the closest thing to that is Heinz 57, which is, is I guess kind of close, like a sour barbecue sauce. But screw all that noise. I'm making Cajun ketchup because Cajun seasoning is delicious. I normally don't like ketchup on a breakfast sandwich or anything breakfast, but I actually really enjoy the Cajun ketchup with the breakfast wrap. That does not taste like ketchup. It tastes amazing. I don't consider this ketchup anymore, okay? We changed it up. It's now a new thing. Shout out to Popeyes UK. So here's the situation, guys. I was um, originally gonna use regular pork sausage, but it's Popeyes, you know? Or is it? It's not really Popeyes, it's really me. And the, you know, I can do however the fuck I want. That's the beauty of me cooking. So we're gonna use some chicken sausage and I'm gonna use some parchment paper here to press down the sausage. Just to be consistent with everything, I'm gonna season it with more Cajun seasoning. We're gonna air fry some hash browns. I'm not making this just from scratch. Before we do that, we're gonna hit it with some spray. Cajun seasoning. Guys, this is a Cajun breakfast wrap. I take my Cajun seriously. Maybe it's too much, maybe not. I, I'm not in the UK to know, so we're just going for it. Listen, at this point, I'm super pumped. We have our chicken sausage, Cajun seasoned, bacon, Cajun seasoned, hash browns, Cajun seasoned. I actually didn't try these yet. You know what I'm thinking about? Five Guys, they got good fries. They have the Cajun fries at Five Guys, smart. I got nothing really to say about Five Guys other than I love it. Uh, it's undeniably one of the more unique fast casual burger joints. Not only are they unique for having regular fries and Cajun fries, but they also give you peanuts when you go there. Is it expensive? Definitely, but it's good. We're gonna fry some eggs. You know what I love about this, this wrap is that each one comes with two eggs. Like normal, we're gonna fry it in some butter. And I like a runny yolk. Maybe you don't. But for the sake of this video, 
I'm gonna break the yolk. All right, this is good to go. Eggs are a little bit runny on top. I'm okay with it. Let's make a wrap. We're gonna grill a panini. Nope, we're not grilling a panini. We're using a panini maker to grill tortillas because the wrap has grill marks on it. So just to be anatomically correct. It's not a joke, guys. I really do love breakfast, okay? I'm not, it's not just for fun. I'm not just doing it because it's easy. I really do love breakfast. I'm obsessed with eggs. I don't know what else to say about it. I love eggs. Anytime I'm thinking that I'm hungry and I don't really want to like work that hard, I'm making eggs. Eggs are like in virtually every single processed food. You can have them a million different ways. Fried egg, poached egg, boiled egg, sunny side up egg, turned over egg egg in a hole, egg in a basket, egg rolled up, Japanese egg, omu rice egg, fried rice has egg in it. Every single thing I just named, delicious. Prove me wrong. Okay, that's something. I'm laying down this flour tortilla, hitting it with some of the Cajun ketchup, adding a few slices of American cheese, followed by some bacon on the side. Fried egg goes on top of the cheese, followed by the sausage, the hash brown, that gets folded up. All right, guys, here's what we got. We got this, fuck, it's not we. Well, you know what, it is the royal we, me and Jeff. Popeyes UK, you, you did it. I didn't even eat this yet and I know it's gonna be a banger. We have the Cajun spicy ketchup, American cheese, fried eggs, Cajun bacon, Cajun chicken sausage, and Cajun Hash brown. I don't even know how to attack this, but here goes nothing. Eggs with the Cajun ketchup, pretty good. Mm. Everything about this is fantastic. Popeyes, where are you at? Why aren't you making this stateside? You're using American cheese and Cajun seasoning. This is so good. If you like me, follow this recipe and make it at home. It's actually pretty simple, and trust me, you're not gonna be disappointed. No, it's too bad today. Should I make a cookbook just on breakfast? Just a breakfast cookbook? Just, it's called breakfast.